Okay, G2 learners, my name is Ms. Hanin and I'll be giving you visual art. That means you just you theme free. How we organize ourselves. In this theme, we will be talking about the related concept movement and art. So I want you to move. Let's see what moves in art. We will use our thinking skills to make unexpected or unusual connections between ideas and the objects you will be creating. Let's be introduced to you the element of our lines. And everything starts with a line, of course. But before we start, we need to look around us. There are a lot of types of lines around us, which as you might see on your left, different types of lines, such as straight line, broken line, zigzag, wavy, curve, spiral. These are all types of lines. But where can we find them around us? Can you find anything around you, KG? Oh, yes, you found a door. The door is straight. So a straight door is an example of lines. And it has a straight line. If you look at your right, the right images, they contain the first one is water. What kind of lines do you see? Do you see wavy lines? Yes, if you did, that's true. Let's see the second photo on your right. Oh, this is wind. What kind of line have they used? Have they used zigzag, wavy, or curved, or spiral? or straight or might be broken think for a moment yes it's true it's spiral we will learn about how lines in an artwork can make a movement hello learners let me introduce week one and week two can lines move? Do you think lines can run? Or can they walk in a painting? Yes, we can make them move, but they don't move. We will learn during this week how to create an artwork using curved line. But what in real life has curved lines? So if you put your hand straight with me, I want you to move your lines up and down. What's like that? Let's think a bit. Yes, it's true. It's water. Water is an example of curved lines. Water, water. Curve lines, curve lines. Wow, they are used curve lines. During the art class, you will make curve lines. So, can lines move? Do you think so? The answer is yes or no. Let's see together during the week. Things you'll see and we will use during art classes. Of course, we're going to use scissors, glue, reader, colors, paper, pencils. We will use all of them. I can't wait to see you. KJ2 learns.